Hi there. So in this video, we're going to see how to set timeout in your JUnit test. So we have our before and after class and at the rate test. And I want to add one more method that will timeout after a specific time. So I'm going to use at the rate test. And I'm going to specify time as let's say 2000 or you can even specify lower if you want. Here you specify your method, let's say test 4. And inside that, I want to run this loop forever. Okay. And I want it to time out after 1000 ms. So when this test will run, it will flag us some error, okay? And it will notify that this particular test is timed out. So right click on your Java class, run as JUnit test. Okay, so if you look at terminal, you'll find that only three methods output is visible before method after method class and test method okay and if you look at right hand side you will find that one of our test four is failed because that timed out after 1000 ms so you get two test runs properly with one having error okay and that error is stressed at this location when you double click on that it will show you where it was okay so if you want to run a test for a particular length of time and you want it to have timeout after that then you can use timeout equals to specific time period as argument inside your test annotations okay so at the rate test method annotation has timeout parameter that you can use so this it can be handy in cases such as you want to connect to a particular server but after a particular time period you want it to time out if it doesn't connect okay you can also have some database access you want to have some return error if it fails to connect for let's say one minute or three minute so in such case, timeout can be useful.